Hey everyone, and welcome back to another eShop Deals video. Now this week we've got a slightly shorter list with about 20 games to take a look at. However, just as usual, I give the same reminder, don't forget to check out last week's video. Especially in this case, there are still a ton of those deals running, and if you want to make sure you're not missing out, that video is still very relevant. Also, in case you missed it, there's the Cubic Game Sale that's running, I did a separate video on that, check it out if you have the time. Now just before we get to the deals, don't forget that about halfway through the video, we're going to be announcing this week's winner of the $5 eShop gift card. If you're wondering how you can participate in that giveaway, all you got to do is check out the under $5 eShop deals video I do every week around Wednesday. And obviously, the last little thing before we get started, don't forget that if you like the content, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. So first on our list for today is a game that I finally got to try out on the Switch, which is Roller Coaster Tycoon 3D Complete Edition, that is 50% off at $14.99. Now this is a theme park builder, I had originally played it on PC, and I was worried about how the adaptation to the Switch would handle the controls, but you know what, it actually was ported quite well. They streamlined the process also of building the bigger roller coasters, so you know what, if you're looking for a nice park builder with a lot of content at $15, this is a great pickup. Now next on our list, we have a classic entry which is Mario Plus Rabbits, however this time we're looking at the Gold Edition that is 75% off for $19.99. Say it every time, this is Mario Plus Rabbits in an XCOM style tactical shooter. Works very well and on top of it in the Gold Edition, you get the DLC included which is a brand new campaign featuring new characters, basically the characters from the Donkey Kong series. Next, we're going to give another shout out to Agalos that is still 80% off and $2.99. This is basically a retro style 2D platformer slash Metroidvania. And if you're looking for an awesome budget entry for this week, at only $3, Agalos is a no brainer. Now next on the list we have Greek Memories of Asia. Now this is a release sale, it's only 10% off, but we just reviewed this game this week. I did want to give it a shout out at $17.99. If you're into a metroidvania slash puzzle platformer and you want a more big budget entry but with amazing graphics and some really solid gameplay, check out Greek Memories of Asia for this week. If you're unsure, there's a free downloadable demo and you can check out my review. Now next we have the Trine Ultimate Collection that is 80% off at $9.99. Now if you're looking for the ultimate value option from a puzzle platformer, you have it right here. You're getting 4 complete games for only $10, and 3 of those 4 games are excellent entries, with the third one being a little weaker. Now all these games are available separately to pick up, they are also massively on sale. Only thing, if you already own some of them, it makes sense, if not, just pick up this complete collection. Now next, we have another great Metroidvania to look at, Blasphemous, that is 60% off at $9.99. Now this is a Metroidvania for hardcore players, because it has Souls-like combat. This is a very difficult Metroidvania, but the art style here is just amazing, with an extremely dark and gory setting, but nonetheless, this is absolutely one of my favorite Metroidvanias currently on the Switch. On top of it, once again, a free downloadable demo is available. Now this week we have both Torchlight 2 and 3 that are on sale, however my preferred entry is definitely Torchlight 2 at 40% off for $11.99. Although this is an older entry, a lot of people will agree with me that overall I do think that Torchlight 2 is a more solid game. I actually had played the third one first, already liked the gameplay, and when I played the second one I was blown away. Now while we're on the subject, we also have Torchlight 3 on sale, that is 63% off, dropping to $14.79. So once again, top-down action RPG Diablo style combat, but as I said earlier, this would only be a pickup if you've already played the second one, you like the gameplay, and you just want a different experience. Now next on the list, we have Monster Sanctuary, that is 33% off at $13.39. Now this is basically, once again, a Metroidvania, but meets almost like a Pokemon game. Because basically you are going to be collecting monsters, training monsters, and fighting with teams of three. The combat is very original here, however, so don't expect the basic turn-based combat of Pokemon. You really have to synergize between your three characters. Once again, I actually fully reviewed this game on the channel. You can check that out. 
Now, next on the list, we have an awesome entry with Worms WMD at 75% off for $7.49. Now, this is another tactical shooter, although this time you're controlling a group of weaponized worms. And when I'm saying weaponized, I mean machine guns, rocket launchers, and even eventually tanks and different vehicles. This is some crazy gameplay, but at the same time, that requires a lot of strategy. And if you've never played a Worms game, definitely give it a try at this price if you're into any kind of strategy strategy play. Next on the list, we have Ukulele and the Impossible Lair at 75% off for only $7.49. Now this is a 2D side-scrolling platformer, think Donkey Kong Country, with almost the same production values although at only $7.50. This is actually currently one of my top 10 2D platformers on the Nintendo Switch. It is an overall great experience. If you're into that genre and you haven't tried this yet, at least give the free downloadable demo a try. So now it's time to take a quick break and look at this week's winner of the $5 eShop gift card. And this week's winner is going to be Montana that said, holy cow, I'm fixing to be spending some money. And I agree, Montana, this week's list of under $5 games had a ton of great games on it. Hopefully, the $5 eShop gift card is going to help you out a little bit with that. So all you need to do to claim your prize is reach out to me in my pinned comment down below in this video. Next, we have Neon Abyss at 33% off for $13.39. Now, this is a 2D side-scrolling action platformer roguelite, and it is actually a pretty good one at that. On top of it, it has some beautiful cartoon-like graphics. And lastly, it's even been announced to be getting a limited run game's physical release. Now next, we have Evergate that is still 33% off at $6.69. Now this is a truly beautiful 2D puzzle platformer that has some really stellar gameplay on top of it. And at this price, it is honestly a steal. I would even recommend this game when it's full price at even $10. I'm going to give another shout out to a regular here, which is Val Ferris, that is 55% off for $11.24. Now, this is a 2D action shooter. It is very difficult, but it has truly great graphics and backed by an amazing heavy metal soundtrack. I do always give the warning that there is a double pack for this and Slain together that's only a couple of bucks extra and overall is a better deal. But if you're looking at picking up only this game at 11.24, it is nonetheless a very, very good pickup. Now next, we have Pumpkin Jack that is back to 40% off at $7.99. Now this is one of my favorite 3D action platformers on the Switch. And yes, it's an indie title developed by only one person. It evokes a lot the medieval series that we know from the PlayStation. And honestly, I love to suggest it and we're finally getting deals that bring it under $20 because I really want to see a sequel to this game. Now next on the list, we have The Escapists 2 Game of the Year Edition at 75% off for $6.74. Now this basically is a sandbox style game where you have one goal to escape from prison. It is an awesome game to also play in co-op where you can either work together or even against each other to see who breaks out first. Overall, this is great value at only $6.74, especially the Game of the Year Edition with all the DLC. Now next, we have Hob the Definitive Edition that is making a return at 40% off for $11.99. Now this is a 3D action puzzle platformer, very along the lines of what you get from a 3D Zelda. And honestly, at $12, you get quite an epic adventure for a low, low price. Once again, this is another game this week with a free downloadable demo. It seems like a theme this week. If you need to convince yourself, give it a try. Now next, we have another game making a return, which is Fury Unleashed, that is 55% off at only $8.99. Now this is a 2D side-scrolling roguelite shooter. Imagine Contra meets a roguelite, with the difficulty level at the Contra level. On top of it, it has an amazing co-op mode as well. If you're in for a challenge this week, look at picking this one up. Now next on the list, we have... Power Rangers Battle for the Grid, the Collector's Edition, at 33% off for $19.49. Now, I know what probably a lot of you are thinking, a Power Rangers game, but yes, this is a seriously well-done 2D fighter. And on top of it, in this collection here, you're getting already some of the DLC characters. And there are some new ones that were just launched 
featuring Street Fighter characters, so a Power Rangers version of Ryu and Chun-Li that if you like this base version of the game, you can actually invest in. Now once again, last but definitely not least on this week's of suggested games, we have Oli Oli Switch stands at 80% off for $2.99. Now, this is a game that I pulled from this week's under $5 list, but it's such amazing value that I had to talk about it here. First, you get the two Ollie Ollie games in one pack for only $3. And these are 2D sort of auto runners, but with skateboard like mechanics. And overall, they're just great adventures for anyone who's even just into 2D platformers. At $3, this is definitely a must have. Now, just before we go, we're going to do something new for this week that someone had suggested in a previous video. We're going to look at a couple of games that I would actually avoid for this week. And the first one of those deals that you should definitely avoid is going to be Gleamlight at 50% off for $9.99. Now, this is an attempt at a Metroidvania, and they sort of try to copy slightly the style of Hollow Knight, but this game possibly has one of the worst executions in that style that I've ever seen. And even at $10, you should stay away from this deal. I really would never recommend picking it up. And the second deal I would say I would definitely avoid would be Taxi Chaos at 28% for $24.95. Now look, personally, I had high hopes for this game. I even bought a physical copy of it. But unfortunately, it is definitely not what I would call a successor to Crazy Taxi. There's a lot of pieces missing here. There's not enough content. And definitely at $24.95, there are way better places to be putting your money currently. So this is another one that I would definitely for the moment stay away from unless they do some major patching and add in a ton of stuff. So that was pretty much it for this week's list of eShop deals. Now, I know the list is a little shorter than lately, but you know what? I still think there were a ton of really great games. Now, as usual, I love to hear from all of you. So please let me know what games you picked up this week. And also, how are you liking the addition of the timestamps? And I also have to really thank the channel supporters. They are helping a ton to help the channel grow. And if you want any information on memberships, it's available down below in the link. And just on the way out, as I said at the beginning, don't forget to hit the like button if you like the content, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and hit that notification bell so you know when all my future content comes out. And as usual, I hope I'll see you in my next video.